The ability to view images associated with positions on a dimension is useful in many aspects of the retail world, such as assortment planning, item planning, and storyboarding. I can use images to storyboard themes by creating a collection of looks and colors for a particular buying period, floor set, or flow. Some retailers associate multiple types of images with multiple levels of the product dimension. I can then associate images for product levels such as department, class, subclass, style, and style color. Images are also helpful in selecting assortment options in visual planning. Pivot table headers display images for visible media dimension attributes. I can see the primary image of the image attribute available for the given level. I can right click on the image and perform the following actions including view manage images, manage attributes, hide images, and show images separately. I can view and manage images. I can select the attribute, dimension, and level at which to add the images. I can view the image as a full or thumbnail and the main image along with any other existing images for that level. I can add the image URL and click on Replace to add an image. Also, images can be included in a domain by configuring media dimension attributes and then loading them with the media bundle values referring to images and making them visible in the worksheets. I can resize the image rows and columns in the pivot table and see them persisted so that I don't need to resize them again. If I ever need to hide them, a simple right click and select Hide Images works quickly. To get them back, I repeat the process and choose Show Images. Another great feature is that I can combine my attributes with my images. Here I can right click on the image and select Show Attributes. Now my images are labeled with the color while I still can scan through my image choices that are on display.